the world's most advanced cold wallet for the new generation of cryptocurrency lovers. So if you are interested in buying this decent wallet, you can find a link in the description down below where you will get a 20% discount. Thank you very much and let's dig in the video. What's up XRP family? Thank you guys for joining the video for today. Guys, do not forget that safety is first. So be sure that you never give your keys because it's happening, guys. It's happening. People are giving their keys. People are using um, very dangerous links and their, their XRP is being stolen. So please be careful, guys. So here we have Steven W. Uber. I never tested XLM, but since it is built similarly to XRP, Jed McCallop unsettles me a bit. I don't know what to make of him. Also, that the blockchain has already had severe, several failures this year and transactions were stopped for hours makes me a little uncertain. So this is actually his opinion about XLM, guys. The XLM ledger is more, much more centralized than that of XRP, with the holdings being less centralized in return. Personally, I put more emphasis on the technology. That's why I like XRP better, but XLM is also a great project. My opinion is a bit the same uh, regarding XLM, because many people have been ask, asking me, actually, what do you think about XLM? Here it is, guys. I have a bit of the same opinion. So here we go here we have beyond bitcoin the future of digital assets is bigger than the first crypto while bitcoin is more most recognizable digital asset is just one asset class among many that are here to evolve financial services globally guys understand that bitcoin is gonna be flipped very very soon and there are certain things happening right now and we are really really close to something very big so I will show you some other stuff that is actually related and um, shows actually that we are really having something very weird going on right now. So the first international regulations were handed down in Japan in 2016 after hacks against crypto exchanges, including an 850,000 Bitcoin theft against Mt. Gox because the success of any financial market is based on predictability, security and general market efficiency. Regulators continue to contemplate the direction and viability of their involvement with cryptocurrency. Now, all of this, guys, has to do with regulation because it's coming. Maybe XRP will be the first ever regulated coin out there. We have a price of $1.08, guys. After the tweet of David Schwartz, we really went up and we actually called the bottom there. Expect the biggest crash in world history, guys. This month of October, BTC gold stocks. The crash has already been triggered and so it begins. This is the real Kiyosaki. This is Robert Kiyosaki. This is the guy who actually wrote Rich Dad Poor Dad. If you didn't read that, go read that, guys. Very, very good book. So actually, he is saying that there is a big crash going to happen. And believe me, guys, it is something that will happen very, very soon because they are printing enormous amounts of fiat currency fiat currency is the most crap that you can have right now guys because it's really an inflationary uh thing so look at deflationary assets guys and put, be sure that you put your money in these things instead of your savings see leo for links to collection of speakers at apex all things xrp ledger diving into the tech is the needed balance while gary genser fumbles the ball so guys you can go to this link and you can actually uh, watch this video it's very interesting it's about the xrpl ledger it's a lot of things and you will see how huge xrp ledger actually is and what is happening now on it it's really really big so here hey sec how about settling xrp lawsuit this won't end well you know let's take a look guys so here you can see almost immediately after leaving the sec clayton was hired by one river digital asset management a crypto hedge fund that quietly made a huge financial bet exclusively on bitcoin now here you can see guys an, an ether starting shortly before the ripple lawsuit was filed what a coincidence less than a month after filing the ripple lawsuit sec enforcement director mark berger left the agency to join simpson thatcher and bartlett of the enterprise ethereum alliance what a coincidence from 2017 to 2020 the same years he served at the sec hinman received over 15 million in payments from simpson thatcher and bartlett what a coincidence 
Immediately after leaving the SEC, Hinman returned to Simpson Thatcher Bartlett. He also named senior advisor to a new $2 billion crypto fund at Andreessen Horowitz. What a coincidence. All of this is happening, guys. The above-mentioned document may be the evidence Ripple's looking for it aims to prove the SEC lied about the nature of its deliberations. Ripple's attorneys are placing the SEC between two options. Its officials' views on digital assets, including Hinman's speech, are only personal opinions, which means there is no deliberative process privilege case to be made. Its officials' views were policy, there is DPP case to be made, but Hinman's speech and other officials' views can be used as evidence against the SEC in the lawsuit. So, it's really, really obvious, guys, and the judge has seen a lot by right, by right now. So, it's gonna be very, very spicy. Attorney Jeremy Hogan commented on the legal analysis and said there can only be, there can be only one of three things. XRP is not a security. Enough said. XRP is maybe a security. This is fair note as gold. XRP is a security. If so, why try so hard to hide the analysis? Judge Sarah Nepburn will be the one making the ruling regarding the privilege issue, but the SEC has already been ordered to hand over many of those documents to Ripple's attorney. And despite the judge's orders, the agency refused to do so. This is the SEC's last chance and it looks quite bleak for the plaintiff. So, you tell me guys who is winning this case and it's not just by um, a small bit it's by a very long run the turning point is now with regulation seems like the us is on its way to facilitate crypto innovation if anything helps it proceed for greater adoption what do you think miami mayor courting crypto miners sees us turning point uh this is francis suarez the mayor of miami said he's trying to capitalize on a major shift towards mining cryptos in the U.S. amid a widespread crackdown on such activities in China. The turning point is now, he said. It creates an incredible opportunity for America. Suarez said he's been actively trying to sell crypto miners on the opportunities in South Florida, including clean energy options, such as nuclear, solar, and hydroelectric. That may be amenable to investors with a heightened concern for the environmental impact of the energy-intensive industry. Suarez noted that he has spoken to utility Florida Power and Light Company Chief Executive Eric Salaji about luring crypto business to the area. He said he has tried to put people together with the Next Era Energy Inc., a subsidiary to consider mining opportunities. Um, and, and look, I, I think really the, the point of the story that you really need to walk away with is a lot of people are starting to understand this is a turning point very soon here in crypto. Either America is going to stifle innovation or we are going to uh, lead innovation. And I think over the next one to two years, that decision has got to be made and it's got to be very clearly on the side of innovation. Now, if you if you watch this, guys, there is a turning point And I think that the Ripple lawsuit is playing a very big, um, a very big uh, role in this change, guys, because it's really on the brink of settling and it will be the first crypto that will change the whole space either america will lead this innovation or it will really stifle and it will be bad and they will turn to other countries chinese regulators unite forces to crack down on crypto now this is why he is saying that this is the turning point because china is actually banning crypto and they have so many laws and 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 censoring all of these things guys and this is the biggest opportunity for america actually to lead this innovation and make it good financial management department cyber security and information departments telecommunications departments public security market supervision work closely together to cut off payment channels dispose of relevant websites and mobile application in accordance with the law now why do you think they are doing that guys they are afraid of this new asset class which is growing so fast and here you can see director of payment and settlement department at the people's bank of china expressed concerns over the growing popularity of cryptocurrencies and stable coins calling for more measures for the traditional financial system to compete with the industry now this will not happen guys the traditional financial system is collapsing in front of your eyes please remember here we have james rule xrp another community member loses seventy four thousand dollars due to an online scam acting as support 
Do not trust anyone. Be patient. Do your research before assuming that they are the source. Never. Guys, never, never send anything to anyone that is trying to support you or anyone that is trying to ask for your wallet, for your uh, passwords, for anything, because this is always a red flag, guys. Please be careful out there. I think XRP is ready to move towards $2. I still think we will see $10 and beyond this bull run. This may be the bottom that we have seen, guys, and we may go up and see ten dollars finally for xrp i also made some more connection to these days i think october november will be very lovely so you can see a lot of uh decoding here guys by raya rose mr pool tweets very interesting what is your ruling planet and its meaning mars is the ruling planet of scorpio and it is the planet of power and vigor let's see what will happen guys october 11th flipping to the 6th october january 31st 2022 will be very very significant guys remember iso 200 2022 it's not just by coincidence this name 133 in my opinion is code for october 1033 more or less i have a feeling october will bring prosperity september 30th marks end of phase two please three shall be fire here we have Stephen W. Uber again. Only interoperability will give native tokens true value. When people talk about CBDCs or stablecoins making XRP redundant, they miss this point. It's about replacing trust and connecting as many market participants and interests as possible. XRP is unbeatable in this respect. This is exactly what people mean when they talk about too much friction. Only efficient ledgers enable value exchange across multiple blockchains and technologies the future will be neither on one nor 10,000 blockchains but perhaps on 30 and the technologies that efficiently connect the values of these 30 blockchains will win proof of work is too friction intensive and will never enable efficient interoperability across multiple blockchains that is why plw will disappear altogether maybe bitcoin will survive as a store of value on an efficient blockchain but i doubt even that now listen to this guys because this is really happening xrp is really the most efficient uh, coin out there to settle payments to move value from one to another and this is the most important aspect that is there and bitcoin will cease to exist as just a store of value definitely the internet is being shut down guys in australia specifically but don't think that it's not going to happen soon everywhere let's take a look Red alert, guys. They have started censoring social media on behalf of the governments. You cannot even post anything from Australia on Facebook anymore because they're about to go full-on tyranny in Australia. And if you think they're not going to try the exact same thing here, you're a fucking idiot. Now, maybe this is exactly what we have been waiting for, guys. If this happens, imagine this is what we actually predicted will happen when XRP moves to the top. Thank you very much for watching the video guys. See you in the next one. Cheers.